bitch. A nigga is in Peru. Quit playing with me. Checked in at the airport. I got um bought my ticket to Machu Picchu, my train ticket to Machu Picchu. They have like a stand over there somewhere. I'm waiting to go to Cusco. Um, yeah, there's not much. It was very easy. I thought it was gonna take me a super long time, but I'm used to Atlanta's airport. Um, it wasn't, it was nothing. I got through easy and then um, now I'm just waiting. I have like an hour to board. So, just wait for that. Bitch, I just got to my hotel and it's so cute. Ah! Bienvenidos. Ah! So I am in freaking Cusco and I'm in the most beautiful hotel ever. Oh my gosh. So if you're new here, bienvenidos. My name is Daji Imara. Welcome to your favorite solo travel channel. Yep, I already made a decision for you, boo. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button so you could just be a part of the fam and you good to go. <laughs> I'm out of breath because in Cusco, there's an altitude difference, so I think I'm like a that a lot of that. Oh, Jesus, I think I'm like 11,000 feet up in the air, whatever the fuck, but kind of out of breath. So it's my first day in Cusco, bitch, and I'm excited. I just filmed my little um, hotel tour, so make sure y'all check that out. My, they just came and dropped off some coca tea for me. Hold on. It's hot as hell, so I'm gonna let it cool down. But this is to help with altitude sickness. Um, I'm about to unpack because I got shit to do. So what I wanna go do is get something to eat and then chill. Like today is gonna be a real relaxing day. I have to go make arrangements to get me to the bus station because tomorrow I'm going to Agos Caliente so that I can go to Machu Picchu. Um, yeah, so that's what I got going on. But I'm in Cusco, bitch, I'm in Cusco. Ah. Peru was cute. I'll be back to Peru before I go back to Atlanta, but Peru was cute. But I'm in Cusco. I can't believe I'm in Peru. Like, who, who you know out here going to Peru? Like, who, who going to Peru, bitch? Come on, who's playing with me, yo? Life of a content creator, bitch. I'm in here trying to get other shots. I'm trying to get some shots for the gram in the TikTok. Make sure you follow me on there. Um, so I gotta pull out my other tripod. <laughs> I don't even know how to keep this from falling. Okay. Exchange some money. <laughs> I'm in Plaza de Armas. I'm here to exchange money, but I'm tired, so I'm taking a break. <laughs> and I'm gonna get something to eat and then chill for the rest of the night. Like, I'm so exhausted, and I gotta be up mad early tomorrow. So, yeah. Okay, I exchanged money. This whole street, you can actually exchange money here. So, I didn't have to go to like one place. I'm about to find some place to eat. They got like a lot of ice cream places here. Like a lot of ice cream places. Let's see. So I'm at this burger joint and 
They were adding a lot of the things I wanted, but I'm fine. So I'm basically eating a burger, but I needed to eat something. I'm so hungry. Ha ha haven't had anything since breakfast. <sighs> yeah. So I'm the only one in here. So Llama burger. So I'm gonna try llama for the first time. It looked like it looks so fucking good. Oh my god. Quit playing with red llama. Cusco, quit playing with them. Later that night. Hola. So I'm back in my room and I want to show y'all what I got. I went to the grocery store and picked up a few things just for fun. So first. They have an SPI shore, but it looks more like too hot to handle. Well, she's cute. I love her hair. But anyway, anyway, child, let me put this on mute. So let me do a little grocery haul. So I got these chips. They are hot. I don't know what they're about. I would say fuck it. This juice. They have the coolest looking bottles for all their juice. Like, come on now, it's mango. I got some chocolate. Um, chocolate puran, paru, pu, purano es ancestro. Chocolate purano ancestra. Aquí. And then some candy. And I got some liquor so I can take some shot, 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 So this is just to have with me along the trip. I just needed a cute little personal. And that's it, boo. So, all right, let me tell y'all what the what the dealio is. It is the Thursday, or is it is it's Friday. It's Friday. <laughs> um, and I landed in Cusco today. I'm out of breath, clearly. And what I'm going to do tomorrow is I'm getting on a bus and a train to go to Aguas Calientes, which is where Machu Picchu is. If you come to Cusco, Machu, Machu Picchu isn't like you could just pull up to Machu Picchu. It's in another town hours away outside of Cusco. So you can take, take buses there. You could take a bus and a train, which is which is what I'm doing because of the route. Um, I chose like the most expensive bus, Vista Dome. Um, I'll talk I'll make, talk about that later, but yeah, I am going to get up at like three o'clock in the morning because the bus picks me up at 4.40 a.m. I have to take a taxi to the bus stop, bus to the train station, train to Aguas Calientes, go to my hostel. The next morning, oh, and then I'm gonna kick it there in Aguas Calientes. And the next morning, I'm gonna go to Machu Picchu and then take the train back to the bus station, bus station back to Cusco and back here. So tomorrow, the next two days are gonna be very eventful. Pero like, I'm excited. So that's all I gotta say to y'all. I'm calling it a night. I'm about to edit, like, not edit, but organize all my videos. Like, I have all my camera stuff here charging so i'm about to basically take all my footage and save it and everything i, ha I haven't decided if i'm if i'm going to take my laptop i don't know definitely keep my clothes here i'm only taking a bag because you can't really take um where am i going with this you can't really take suitcases to aguas calientes up there to machu picchu so i'm just going to take a, i'm only going to be there one night so i'm going to take one bag and that be it because child I'm not taking these suitcases. I already unpacked everything and put it in the wardrobe, so I'm definitely not doing that. So, calling it a night. About to put footage on my um, hard drive, and I'm taking a bath, and I'm gonna watch movies, and I'm gonna go to bed early because I gotta get up at three o'clock in the morning because I gotta go to Aguas Calientes so I can go to Machu Picchu. Like it's too much. It's too much. Um, yeah, that's all I gotta say. Bye. Two days later. Buenos dias. <laughs> so let me fill y'all in what's been happening. So yesterday I was in um, Aguas Calientes and I went to Machu Picchu. Machu Picchu getting his own separate vlog. Oh my God. 
I can't believe I finally was able to see one of the seven wonders of the world. Next one coming up soon though. Next, the next wonder coming up real, real soon. This is gonna be my favorite one, I think. Um, so after that, went back to my hostel. I ended up, you know, paying a little extra money. It was only 20 USD, which was 60, 60 soles. And I stayed there till two o'clock. Um, slept, went to eat. My dumb ass can't read military time, so I missed my train back to Cusco. Um, by 20 minutes which was so dumb it was so stupid and then I when I got there I was like oh my god and they was like no you missed your train but the train just came up so thankfully within 20 minutes of me missing my train and me getting to the train station there was another train they're like all right we will let you in. it's just you we'll let you in and then the same with the bus and this was better because it ended up being less people like I was it was crowded on the first bus going to Aguas Calientes but like this one was very I could put my feet up I could sleep I could relax they still had the entertainment um yeah so I was able to break it back to Cusco but learn how to read military time when you travel in the world okay and I felt like I knew what time it was, but I was just, I'm dumb. That's all I got to say about that. Got back here, ate breakfast, ate dinner at my hotel, took a shower, watched Euphoria. Oh my God, did y'all see Euphoria? Nate, Cassie, like what's going on? Oh my God, anyway. But it's the next day. I just went to have breakfast downstairs. Um, I booked to go to Rainbow Mountain tomorrow. I booked a food tour for tonight. Um, I only have three more days. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Four more days left in uh, Peru. I'm enjoying myself. I'm so happy that my tour, that, that, that ex the activity I have planned for today is later on in the afternoon. Um, I'm going to go to the mall to try to get a swimsuit because I'm going to book a spa day for tomorrow when I come back from Rainbow Mountain. Because that's going to be another 12 hour day. Got to catch a bus for three hours do the activity hike come back like i've been doing hiking and stuff like i've been hiking girl okay okay but anyway so i'm gonna try to get a spa after and then eat here and then the next morning go back to lima be at lima for two days and fly back to atlanta to see my puppy i miss him so much but that's all that's been going on with me um it's nine o'clock in the morning like i said i just had breakfast um i'm gonna chill here and edit some content well I may or may not edit, but I'm definitely exporting everything onto my hard drive just in case. I think I took over a thousand pictures in this last four days. A thousand pictures and videos I've been posting. So make sure you follow me on Instagram because the content that won't be here is going to be on there and TikTok. So uh, I just know this like, this Peru content is going to be fire. Fire, okay. But that's all I got today. So today I'm just chilling. I'll probably get back to y'all when I go to the mall later because I'm literally just about to be exporting all my content from my phone and my camera to my computer and organizing it so when I get back to Atlanta edit 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 I don't gotta worry about doing none of that um that's all that's on today's agenda and I'll talk to y'all later because boo I'm in Peru I, this hotel y'all will see the hotel tour but this hotel oh my god there's no way I would have got this much bang for my buck anywhere in the United States of America. I would have to have like um, points for like a hotel, like a Marriott or something to get something like it's so bomb. I don't know why they had it was discounted basically over 50% off. Uh, I, if you come to Cusco, you have to stay in this hotel. Um, again, the hotel tour, if it's not up already, it will be. So make sure you subscribe. So I'm up, it's late on the day, it's about four o'clock and I booked a um, tour today, but it was canceled. So I guess I'm gonna be walking around Cusco doing whatever child, cause I don't have no plans um, for today at least. I guess that's good because I've been going like nonstop every single day since I've been on vacation. So I guess this one day when I don't have nothing to do and I can just explore Cusco for myself, I guess that's fine, but I must go get something to eat child, okay? Oh my hat. 
on my phone. Man, fuck this thing. So, I just ate dinner and had gelato. And I'm going my way back to the hotel to take a hot bath and watch Enough with J-Lo because it's my favorite movie. But I bought a sombrero for Rainbow Mountain tomorrow. I like to say, I'm super proud of myself for the amount of Spanish I'm speaking because, baby, when I underestimated the amount of Spanish I could actually speak, and it was due to just embarrassment. Like, we just be like, oh no, I don't want to speak it because I don't know enough. Like, bitch, you can't learn if you don't speak it. I need to go to a fucking grocery store. No, but I just. Maybe later. Maybe later. No, but I just go. Yes. But like, you can't learn a language if you don't fucking speak it. So I had no other choice, but everybody don't want to speak English like that. So proud of myself. But run out of breath because the altitude, child. Later that night. sweatsuit on this is like the extra outfit i always i carried in my carry-on always have have an outfit in your carry-on especially if you have um layovers just in case your luggage gets lost um i'm gonna sit here and watch all of us are dead which is a korean um tv show about a zombie apocalypse in a school or some shit like that and i have a massage later and i'm gonna order room service and i'm gonna take a hot ass bath love this for me love it for me so that's what's on tonight's agenda. Um, I'll leave back to Luma, Peru, Luma, Lima tomorrow. Gonna be there all day tomorrow and then all day the next day and I fly back home to Atlanta. So I have two more days in Peru, two more full days. And yeah, I miss my dog so much. Like I'm having a good ass time, but I miss my dog. Like I miss my dog. Like the amount of stray dogs here makes me like, ugh, my baby, like does he even remember me? Does he know who his mommy is anymore? But yeah, so I got my room service and it looks delicioso. Um, I'm about to grub and watch All of Us Are Dead, like I said, and pack majority of my things and then go to sleep. I need to book my COVID test and but try to see if I can book to, um, what am I trying to do? Trying to see if I could book to ride horses when I go to Lima. I really want to ride horses again. But that's it for tonight and I'm going to sleep. So I'll see you all in the morning.